Welcome to Eprajna. In this video, we will see the multiple choice questions that is MCQ related to the basics of manufacturing processes. Now, the interesting thing about this MCQ is that all these MCQs are concept based. So, there is one, one MCQ on one concept. So, once you learn one concept through one MCQ, you can solve any kind of a variation for the same problem. So, let us begin. First question which is the oldest method of manufacturing and options given are welding, metal removal by machine tool, metal forming and casting and the correct answer is casting. Now this is one of the oldest casting which was found in Mohenjo-daro and this is known by the dancing girl scripture which is made up of copper alloy and it is believed that it was made by a lost wax technique one of the casting technique and it is approximately 6000 years old let us move to the second question manufacturing is the principal activity related to and the options are primary industry secondary industry tertiary industry and special industry and the correct answer is secondary industry now let us see what are these different industries are so primary industry is basically those industries which extract the natural resources right from the earth like agriculture or forestry or mining so from mining we get the metals and secondary industries are those which convert the uh, resources natural resources into some useful product like automobile uh, industry okay or petroleum refineries so all these things are coming under secondary so our manufacturing industry is coming under the secondary kind of an industries and tertiary industry is related to the service like banking and communication and hotel and um, insurance and those kind of things. So let us move to the third question. Manufacturing is the application of physical and chemical processes to alter the dash dash of a given starting material to make part or products. And options given are geometry, properties, appearance, and all of these. And the correct answer is all of these. Now, what is a manufacturing process? So, manufacturing process is a application of some physical and chemical processes with the help of machinery, tooling, power, and labor. Here, starting material is converted into some processed part, which is of some kind of an use, right? So, this is a kind of a complete definition of a manufacturing processes. Which of these is not a major category of a manufacturing process? And options given are bending process, material removal process, forming process, and casting process. Now remember that it is asked which is not a major category. And the correct answer is bending process. So let us have a look at the various categories of manufacturing process or its classification. So manufacturing process is broadly classified into processing operations and assembly operations. Now in processing operations, there are shaping processes where we change the shape of a material uh, with the help of some either solidification process which is nothing but your casting process particulate process which is nothing but powder metallurgy kind of a process then deformation process which is same as forming process and metal removal process which is metal removal process so out of all these all these three are major categories and this bending process is the subcategory of this deformation process or metal forming process Next question, in which manufacturing process size and shape of material is changed by the application of force and options given are casting, material removal, metal forming and welding and the correct answer is metal forming. Now in metal forming, we apply the force to change the shape and size of a material. Now here is an example of this uh, forging operation where we are pressing this material which is heated uh, to a red uh, red uh, temperature and we are applying pressure that is compressive pressure to change the shape of this material next question which of the following processes start with a material that is in a fluid or semi-fluid state and solidifies the material in a cavity and options are pressing machining forging and casting and the correct answer is casting now casting is the process in which we uh, heat the material uh, to its liquid so that it will become liquid metal and uh, which is either kind of a fluid or semi-fluid state and we 
uh, pour this material into certain cavity and then it takes the shape of the cavity and that is how we get the final product. Which one of the following engineering material is defined as a compound containing metallic and non-metallic elements and options given are ceramic, composite, metal and polymer and the correct answer is ceramic. Now ceramic is the material which is a compound containing metallic and non-metallic elements. Let us see what are the various engineering materials. So the metals, ceramics, polymer and composite are known as the engineering material. Deformation process include which of the following? Casting, extrusion, drilling and milling. And the correct option is extrusion. Now extrusion is a kind of a deformation process or forming process wherein we apply the forces to a material and which is passes through this constricted opening to get a desired shape and size. In the dash dash process, one start with a single block of solid material larger than the final size of desired object and material is removed until the desired shape is reached. And options are subtractive manufacturing, additive manufacturing, formative manufacturing and special manufacturing. And the correct answer is subtractive manufacturing. Now here is an example of an uh, wood turning. So this is the bench lathe and there is a wood stock which is being turned by this hand tool. Now to get the desired shape we are using a block of material and we are removing the material from this block right and that is how we are changing the size and shape and we are subtracting the material right from starting material to get the desired product that is why it is called as a subtractive manufacturing and the last question is dash dash process builds part layer by layer by depositing material according to digital 3d design data and the options again are subtractive manufacturing additive manufacturing formative manufacturing and special manufacturing and the third answer is additive manufacturing. Now additive manufacturing is a kind of a new technique which is also known as 3D printing wherein we create the products that is 3D products by applying layer of a material over the layer. Now it is kind of a printing a 3D part layer by layer. So this is one of the very recent techniques of a manufacturing process which is known as an additive manufacturing. So these were the some uh, MCQs related to the basics of manufacturing process. Do not forget to subscribe our channel to get more such kind of videos. Thank you.